question number 14 that is 2014 mathematics paper 2 we are told vectors r and s are such that r is equal to 7 i plus 32 j minus k and s is equals to minus i plus j minus k find the magnitude of r plus s now you are taught in form 3 the vector i is represent in three dimension that is it is one zero and zero uh, then we have our vector j is equals to uh, one zero zero and uh, you are uh, uh, you know vector k is equal to 0, 0, 1. So those are the column vectors of i, j, and k. So when you are given r plus, uh, you can write r, you can replace now i, j, and k in terms of the column vector, or we call them position vector. Uh, so we can say uh, r plus uh, j is equal to, first of all, we write r. S so we write 7 our i is one zero zero and uh, then we write plus two our j is uh, zero one zero and we have our k is uh, one uh, that is zero zero one so that is a uh, the vector r it is added to our s our s will say it is minus one into bracket uh, this is a uh, 100 zero, zero, so that is i then we have a uh, plus uh, j which is uh, this is a uh, zero, 010 zero. there we don't have a scalar multiple uh, then we have minus into bracket zero, zero, 001 so at that point uh, what you need to do is to open the brackets uh, then we are going to add so we say this is equals to when you open the brackets this is seven uh, zero zero you just multiply the uh, the constant into the bracket or open the bracket this will give you plus uh, zero two uh, zero uh, and then we have uh, minus uh, zero zero one so we are through with that so this will be because uh, we have plus there uh, we will have uh, minus one uh, this is zero and that is zero or you can still leave it as minus or whatever you choose then we have plus uh, zero one zero and finally we have minus zero zero one so you can add uh, and you find that uh, r plus j uh, is equals to 7 plus 0 minus 0 that is 2 7 uh, plus minus 1 so that we get my we get uh, 6 uh, so that to add up to 6 uh, then we have 0 plus 2 is 2 minus 0 is 2 then we have uh, plus 0 is 2 plus 1 you get 3 minus 0 is uh, so we end up with 3 so we have zero that is zero here uh, we have uh, zero again we have minus one plus plus zero that is minus one uh, then we have uh, that is uh, minus one minus zero is still minus one then we have minus one that will give us uh, minus two uh, so that is a uh, sum of uh, the two vectors that is vector s and r uh, from there uh, to get the magnitude maybe I can uh, mag to get the magnitude of a vector I can use here if you have x y and z uh, like that then uh, the magnitude we normally say uh, it is a square root of uh, x squared plus uh, y squared uh, plus z squared so that so it means that uh, and uh, when you are mo uh, you, you, you will get the magnitude so it means the magnitude of r plus uh, this is uh, our vector s uh, it is equals to uh, the square root of uh, 6 squared uh, plus 3 squared uh, plus minus 2 squared and uh, you can compute that and you'll be able to get it is equals to uh, for the square root of 49 uh, which will give you uh, 7 so that is the magnitude